Here's some do's and don'ts when you're trying to get the stereo image correct when mastering. This plugin that's available in Ozone 10 is pretty cool for doing stereo image stuff. You can select four different bands and you adjust them down here. As you go up, it gets wider and as it goes down, it gets more mono. So for these four different bands, you can adjust them to taste by moving them around. So use your ears. In band one, it's always gonna be the low bass. So keep that a little bit more mono than everywhere else. Now this is going to be the low mids. You can bring that out a little bit. I would always suggest keeping the vocal area and things that are going on in the mid range because there's a lot going on in the mid range. Keep that a little bit more mono, but then open the tops up. That is a great plugin from Ozone 10. Definitely go easy on it because it can really mess with people's mixes if you go too full on. If you want to know exactly how to use Ozone 10, check out the link in my bio.